Okay, another little helpful thing I wanted to show you something that's come in handy sometimes. Let's say I want, I've got too many files, let's say, going in my plan swift. That's not the case so far with this one, but um, let's say I want to get a file out of plan swift and save it for later or I want to move it to Dropbox or something uh, I'm gonna go into my computer uh, go to Windows program files and I'm gonna find plan swift here then you go to data down to storages local if I'm going too fast, you can slow the video down, but uh, go into Jobs. And there you'll see this is the, the plan I've been working on. So now I can copy that. And I can put it in, a, uh, in here. And then I'll be able to access that. I can take this uh, removable disk out and put in another computer and just access that file. Then there's my file right there. Uh, now in the reverse, you can also do the reverse of that. If I go into... Um, I have some here. Let's say I want to take this. Let me make sure. Yeah. All right. So I can copy that. And then just go back to that same spot. And plan Swift. Into Jobs. And I can paste that in here. Then once that's done, um, I don't know, sometimes it may not be, let me see. Yeah, see, it's, you might have to restart the uh, plan swift. Let me pause this and we'll restart Plan Swift. Okay, yeah, so now I've, I've restarted Plan Swift and go to Open Files and, and here it is, it's right here. And I had that job stored on a, a thumb drive, a removable disk, whatever you want to call it. And you can save as many jobs for as long as you want that way and it's still here it's got it's got my takeoffs various items that I needed to take off for that contractor alright hope that one helps